Hey, hi everyone. I'm Saikiran from Let's Upgrade, and today's topic that we are going to discuss is why you should do networking, which is most underrated topic in the entire world. Using networking, you can crack job opportunities. You can crack better mentors and advisors. You can crack industry trends. You should, you will be able to know what exactly is happening in the industry. And the last reason why you should do networking, you know, to find. better collaborators and project partners in a long run so these are the four reasons why you should be doing networking now let's understand what is a checklist to do better networking what's the checklist so here the checklist goes number one thing set a goal be very clear why you are approaching people until unless you don't know what's your goal you need you are approaching someone for mentoring or you are approaching someone for project collaboration you should be very clear so that you are you can shape your conversation you are you can showcase your certain interests like that to the other person the second check is research the group before you go and meet them research about the event or the group of people before you go and meet them this will give you a sense of Uh, understanding what all things that you can talk in that particular event to the particular people the third to do in your checklist prepare your introduction one day before you get into these events this introduction can be like hey hi i am sai kiran i do dash 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 things why 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 organization and i have come up with certain outcomes this is what i am doing and i am more interested in learning certain things this can be the template that can that you can follow for introducing yourself now fourth to do that you have in your checklist ask questions be good at asking questions people are always ready to tell you about their experience but until unless you don't ask questions which are intriguing enough you don't get to gel up with that person so understand how to ask questions i will be dropping in soon a video on how to ask questions very soon on this channel do check out that too in next one now the fifth thing is follow up after the meet up is done after the event is done after that particular conference is done or like you went to some get together that is completed after that do follow up write thank you notes right do just follow up and the last thing the sixth thing is to stay in touch make sure all the people you are investing your time in meeting going to that event and time effort energy just go ahead and make sure that you are staying in touch with all these people god knows what job opportunity what industry trend what collaborator or like what of a mentor or advisor you can get from these all people just stay in touch these are the six things that's the checklist for you to be pro person in networking what are the six number one set a goal number two research the group of the people you are going to meet or the event that you are going to meet number three prepare your introduction before you enter that event number four you ask questions number five follow up number six stay in touch that's it guys this will make you a better person a better developer a better person at networking That's it guys thank you we'll meet you all in the next video take care subscribe to the channel and